Annyeong. <clears throat> All right. We're back with another season's greetings. Da, da, da. And wow, it's almost time <clears throat> to greet the season. It's literally almost the end of 2023, which is kind of wild. Um, yeah, I've been extremely busy the past few days or the past week or God knows how long. I actually received this season's greetings last Friday, so like almost a week ago. But yeah, I went to Bangkok to C17 uh, in their, <clears throat> um, their tour. So yeah, I was away uh, basically the whole of Christmas time and then I was really tired from that and I had work and <sighs> so yeah, I'm here right now unboxing the... 80 Seasons Greetings! So yeah, actually, I thought I was going to buy more Seasons Greetings this year, but I ended up only going with my two regulars, which is um, 80s and 17. I already did the 17 unboxing. I would have liked to have done this a lot earlier because I'm sure that most people have already unboxed this by now, but what the hell, I might as well do it. Um, <clears throat> so we've got the 80s Seasons Greetings. Now, I bought this... And I know a little bit about it, but as is with the Liz special, and also just because I was very busy, I didn't really have time to look up the full details of this. I know that there's like a theme of like jewel thief or something. And I know that there's two types of photo cards that you can get. I know which one I want, so I guess we'll find out. I'm also pretty sure that Yes24 was the only store that did a pc based pub i don't know if the pub is one member or whether it's all of the members but i guess we're gonna find out right now so let's go ahead and open this bad boy up so yes 24 oh okay i think the pub may be ot13 because like it just saw hong Jun's face and it looks like there's more than one card it definitely looks like it so yeah not sure why they put this random thing in here but let's go ahead and take this out and yes it's definitely looking like a set but is this a pub or is this the photo card set because i know that there's two types one of them is like a cute version but surely the actual pc set would be inside um, so let's go ahead and look at these anyway. They're very cute, whatever they are. Does it say? Or maybe the PCs were like, I don't know. Anyway, so yeah, let's go take a look at the folder cards from this. Okay, so I think that these are pubs because I don't remember Jong Ho's um, photo card that I saw looking like this. He looks great. And also, oh my God, Audio Woo, I miss you so much. Audio Woo, please come back to us. You were the best. I love you. So yeah, wow, these are really cute. These are really, really cute. Wow, I, I can't remember the last time I got a, we got an OT8 pub. Is this really a pub? Uh, I'm going to look really stupid if it's not, but <laughs> I can't be bothered to look it up. So I guess I'll find out uh, at the end of the video when I go check if this is a pub. Well, I guess I'll find out if there's another set of photo cards in here. I think that this is a pub. Um, so thanks, Yes24. That's great. I'm really happy with that. Very cute. Uh, I'm not sure if I'll keep all of them. Maybe I'll just keep yours. Um, but we'll see. Okay, so the lighting is terrible. I'm very sorry. So I'm going to hold it like this. Um, but yeah, we have the 2024 season greetings. A tinny's heart that disappeared. Oh, wow. So they, we, they stole our hearts. Who's lying? This is kind of cool. This is giving me uh, mafia vibes. Um, so let's go ahead and open it up. It seems very big. I'm trying to remember if the season's greetings from last year was this big. We're going with the cardboard box, as most groups seem to be doing. Actually, now that I think about it, this does seem like a previous kind of style that AT's used. Um, 
yeah easy to store easy to throw away so if you wanted to do that so there we go okay but ba -da -ba. all right i see another set of photo cards so i think i was correct that these are the pops although i think i didn't get the photo card set that i want which i'm annoyed about but anyway so yeah these look like pops to me so yay thanks yes 24 all right so that's that and then we've got a bunch of stuff in here we've got some postcards we've got the dvd we've got oh the ids i forgot about these yeah because i remember in the in the photo uh, previews that i saw john had glasses so that was the set that i really wanted i don't think i got i think i got the other one <laughs> all right so first of all i'll take everything out and then i just noticed in here we've got this <laughs> so wait these are not numbers though because why is her hetman jongo's number so this is so i'm guessing that's clearly drawn by jongo there so it's it's in a different order it's not the usual order so i guess you're supposed to guess who did it i mean that's obviously san that is that mingi there's only a couple of the members styles of drawing that i can really get i would guess that one would be no wait hong is just surely going to be like the most artistic right the rest of the members i have no idea but anyway that's cute so we've got a little uh drawing challenge there okay so we've got the big calendar we've got the diary and then posters and stuff there's not a photo book really normally there's a photo book that's very interesting why huh was there a photo book in the last one i really liked last year's season greetings actually last year 17 season greetings was really shit um so i ended up using basically all of the 80s stuff um, I used the diary and I had the calendar up in my uh, at my work so yeah I really liked it last year so we'll have to see whether this um, season's greetings this time can live up to the amazingness of the last one so let's go ahead and open the desk calendar first okay so looks like here what is oh they're the suspects Okay, so I guess this is like their plain clothes um, kind of thing. But, and then they're just supposed to be like regular people. And then they transform into um, thieves. Oh, it says here what their, um, it says what their jobs are. Hongjun's art dealer, your sang security team. Oh, Songha promoter, you know, painter. Wait. Oh, college student, you're saying. Security sign, barista, Mickey, <laughs> photographer, and then journalist. Oh, my little boy. Look at him. Oh, my God. For those of you that don't know, John is my bias forever and ever. Oh, my God. This looks like the old 80s logo as well. Ooh, that's giving me a flashback. Okay, so, yeah, I like this. I like this idea of them having, like, a kind of, like, a uh, alter ego kind of thing. Okay, so let's go ahead and look. Is that Wuyang? Oh no, it's Hongjun. Ooh, wow. Oh my god, Hongjun. That's a lot of chains going on there. Okay, ooh, so we have one side is the regular and then the other side is like the thief. So is it going to be two Hongjun? Oh, wow. Okay, so then wait. Now we've got the little teams. Let me go through the, the this page first, and then I'll go through the back pages. It'll be a bit easier for us to do. So, ah, they're so cute. Look at them with their little cookies. Okay, then we've got you know, and he's the painter. Ah, okay, so <clears throat> it alternates between solo member and then team, I guess. Um, but it's not in age order because you know is not after Hongjun. And then Songha. Oh, wow. Ooh. Oh, wait. Maybe they're trying to put them with their birthdays. Because look. There's Yuno's birthday. I like that. I don't like it when they don't... The, the member doesn't match the birthday. I feel like that's stupid. So they tried to do that this time, which is really cool. Okay. Then we've got San and Yuno. So then that could mean that Jongo will be October. 
Yes, because look, here's your Sangi for his birthday. Oh, this is great. Oh, I just went completely past my birthday. So my birthday month is May, which means I have Yuno and San. Ugh, I don't have Jongwon this time. Ah, last time I had Jongwon, I was really happy about it. Oh, okay, never mind. Um, next. Yeah, okay, yeah, we have San for his birthday. Well, it's very lucky that they've got different birthdays on different months. And then... Mingi! Ah, he looks so adorable! Mingi, I love it! And his little drawing as well. September, Wuyong, and then is it going to be my boy? It must be, surely. Yes! <gasps> Whoa! Look at him! Are you seeing this? Yo! Oh my god, this... Sorry, and it's not my camera. I was so happy. This... Oh, I just love a guy with glasses. This is like the ultimate. He's got the little wavy hair. He's got the big, thick glasses. Ah, oh, Jongo, I love you. Wow. Yeah, so as I predicted, Jongo is October. Then who do we have left? Okay. Ah. Wait. Oh, and there's a pair because they. Ooh, so smart. So smart. And then a group one. Ah, Kyo. Oh my god, Jongo looks so great. Ah, oh, I love it. Ah, so I was wondering when Jongo's unit was going to be, and his is the the January one. I always wonder why they do the January of the next calendar because it never gets used. But then I remembered that some people don't get their. Uh, some people aren't as lucky as as people that live in Korea and they don't get their um, uh, season greetings until January. So yeah, that makes more sense. Ah, I love you so much. This is my bias and then who used to be my bias wrecker, but I think actually now uh, your sang is my bias wrecker in 80s. Um, sorry, Sungwa, but you do look really nice in that suit, but um, you don't hold a candle to Jong-un. Jong is by far the best member in 80s. I'm sorry. All right, so now I'm gonna we're gonna see a lot more of the actual thief shots because um yeah it seems like the back like this side was the cute one the regular one and this is going to be like the sexy thief but ooh, we all look so freaking great with this hair i love oreo hair so much both of this is an absolute serve hong Jun giving me just amazing style look at that sassy ass pose and that little pink beret like you rock that and then Wuyong looks absolutely amazing as well oh i forgot i forgot oh my god oh my god look at him who stole a tinny's heart jongo you stole my heart <gasps> look how he's sitting yo oh my god this is incredible yo Okay, I feel like it's going to be October for... <gasps> and then we've got another Wuyang. Oh, more Oreo in my life. Yes. <gasps> wow. Okay, wow. Mingi looks great too. He's getting like, giving me a little bit of Oreo. Ooh, okay. <gasps> Sad as... Okay. I really didn't think I was going to like these pictures as much as the other ones. I still like the other ones more, but damn, these are really good pictures. <gasps> such a nice... Whoa! It's such a nice contrast as well between the two. <gasps> You're saying with, long ha with the short hair. It's kind of been a while since your saying had short hair. <laughs> oh, and then we go back to the cuteness. I really love Yuno like this. Yuno, Yuno to me... De Whoa definitely suits a cuter style more but are you ready are you guys ready for the next picture <gasps> yo songha damn that is a insane look on him <gasps> this like victorian style collar on him is mwah, perfection yo that is incredible okay and then you know wow he looks good though you know, looks like K drama. He looks like a K drama lead, which I guess he already has been a K drama lead. But he looks like, yeah, when he gets a bit older, I think he'll be absolutely perfect for that. Wow! And then we got the. <laughs> I really am enjoying Mingi in this. Actually, Mingi's not someone that normally catches my attention too much, but he's really, yeah, he looks great. 
and then we saw the Hongjun one already. All right, that this calendar was pretty good. And this year it's a portrait calendar. Last year was a landscape one. Um, I'm pretty sure that will still fit on my desk. Although the 17 calendar this year was, was good. So we'll have to see, it's gonna be a little battle to see which one, maybe I'll keep one in my house and one at work. So we'll have to see. Okay, that was pretty good. And then we've got the diary. Now, I'm not going to spend too long on the diary, I don't think. Um, if I remember from last time, there were pictures in this. I really liked the diary from last time because it was also my favorite color, which is green. And then this one is, it's funny, this one's kind of giving me vibes of last year's 17, but just a lot better. God, 17, 17 season greens last time was so shit. Okay, so it does kind of look like a real journal as well. Oh, oh, oh my God, you know, I love a good embossing. Oh my God, when something's embossed like this and it's like, you can feel it, I will just feel it forever. <gasps> wow, okay. So we have our yearly one, I like that. Ah, now is it gonna be, aha, okay. So the 17 one was different. The 17 one had like, the the monthly overview and then it had the weekly ones but this is going for a, like a straight right through the year all the way to um december and as usual we still have the birthdays and things and then ooh, okay <gasps> i like this okay i do also like that they have they stopped numbering um the weeks because sometimes it, it can be easy to like skip weeks and just not write in it and then you can still use you don't have to like have loads of empty useless pages so okay i really like that i also really love this to-do list that's so cool and then the notes oh and then wait huh is this all just a foot wait this is all oh the photo book is here <gasps> But wait, this doesn't seem like many pages. There can't be 50. Really? Is there really 50 pages there? I feel like no. Okay, I guess they're counting on you not using it every week. It could be. It could be 52. And then we've got the blank pages that we can write on. Oh, and the message. And look, they wrote it in English as well. Hey, Tinny, I make happy memories for you all this year as well. I, eventually, I'll go through and read all that in Korean, but their handwriting is not the easiest to read. Um, but yeah, they have the English underneath it. For those of you that don't know Korean, let's all be healthy, don't get sick. Yeah, I wish somewhere. Oh my God, I've never been so sick in my life this year. Korea is like making me sick. Okay, so this half literally half of the diary even more than half is a photo book um so yeah there's where the photo book was liz i swear last time it was definitely not this many pictures in the photo book so i'm gonna go through this quickly because i did my talking through the calendar and you guys don't need to hear me talk more about that so yeah let's do a quick flip through of these pictures and see what they look like i guess it's going to be similar to the calendar so here we go All right, I'm going to pause and go through because I'm guessing the next section is going to be the thief section. I really like this here, this question. They used to ask the same question to everybody, but um, oh my God, crucial clue, if you stole it, where would you hide it? Their answers are freaking hilarious. Like someone saying he would put it in the drawer and Jongo being 
safe and just putting it in the actual safe and then freaking san being like why steal in the first place let's leave an honest life san the whole freaking point of this season's greetings is that you're a thief like come on and then mingi's was the best mingi was how could i possibly hide it i am the jewel the real jewel is mingi Oh, Mingy, I love you in this. This is really turning me around to you. You're great. Oh my God. I love how, I love your look and I love your answer. That's so funny. And then I'm guessing this one is them trying to like psych out who the thief is, but then they're all the thief. So I think, wait, the criminal is Jong Ho. I think he has the face of a criminal. Mingy, okay. Mingi, throw the pie at you. No, how dare you? How dare you say it was Jong Ho? And Hong Jun said, Jong Ho as well. What did he say? Usually in the cases the criminal is Jong Ho, the report he's got all the, all the information. Go away, Jong Ho, uh, Hong Joon. No, it wasn't Jong Ho. Okay, Jong Ho is an angel. Jong Ho would never do that. It's Sam because Jong Ho said that it was okay. All right. So then, this was the first part of the photo book. I really enjoyed that. That was very funny. Um. So now we're gonna move on to that sexy part. Are you ready? Wow, I really like this poo. <gasps> I love this. This is so good. <clears throat> I do really like it when they have two contrasting themes. Like this is such, and also this hits like every kind of fan. You've got the fan. This is almost like Deja Vu Eternal Sunshine. You've got the Deja Vu here and then you've got the Eternal Sunshine with the first one. Yes. I really like it. Oh my God. And Jongo looks absolutely incredible. Look at him. Wanted for always being number one. Yes, Jongo, you are number one. Round face, strong, good with his hands. Excuse me. Anyway, uh, also, I just realized that the pictures from the before are um, the ones here. So I was right about Mingi's. This initially, I said this looked like a Mingi drawing. So I was correct about that. And then obviously that one's your song and then where was Hong Joon's Hong Joon's drawing I didn't get that one <laughs> I did not think that was Hong Joon <laughs> but anyway I really love this having the like Polaroid-y style almost like evidence pictures that's very cool uh Song Ha looks absolutely incredible. I think Song Ha and Jong Ho look the best in this one. Why is his head exploding? I also really like, um, again, the little like comments that they wrote, like this one. Looks handsome when he's eating. Looks handsome when he gets from bed. Looks handsome when he's breathing. <laughs> You're so funny. So yeah, I, I'm enjoying this a lot. Very nice. Okay, okay. So that was the diary. And I kind of like having the diary in the photo book because um, when you when you just have the photo book, you never do anything with it. Like you look at it uh, when you first open it and you're like, great. And then you just literally never use it again. Whereas where if you have the it within the diary, you're carrying it around everywhere with you. And it's not super heavy as well. So yes, I like this. I really like this a lot. Security level eight or above required. <laughs> so very good. This says digital planner. I'm guessing is this oh, okay. So yeah, this has some kind of QR code. And then I guess from that you can download it and do a PDF. Okay, interesting. I'm not sure how I would use that, but okay. Then, then we've got the DVD. And what are these things? These are like post. Oh, the IDs. Okay, wait. This looks like a poster. So should we look at the poster first? Oh, 
<gasps> is it a wanted? Oh, I thought it was a wanted poster. Ooh. Oh, it's like a big calendar. Okay, so this one is one that you can like put on your wall. That's kind of cool. I like how they're using this one as well. Although it seems to me like they've got a lot more like the postcard and the ID and this are all the, the cuter one. So yeah, the ID photos. The one thing I don't like about these ID photos is that they are all, you're supposed, you have to like cut them, which I don't like that. I like it when they're already pre-cut because I don't trust my cutting skills to get it right. So yeah, I'll never be cutting these up. I'm just going to keep it like this. Um, it's a little bit weird that they have like a straight face and then a slightly smiling face because most of them just look exactly the same. And to be honest, Jaws looks a bit weird. <laughs> His smile is a bit creepy. Sorry, John, I love you, but... Yeah, but the rest of them, literally, he's, his is the only one that's, like, noticeably different. Maybe your sang as well. But your sang smile is very cute. Yuno's looks almost identical. Like, you cannot really tell the difference between those two. Um, so, yeah. Okay, so those are the IDs. What's this? Ah! Oh, for fuck's sake. Okay, I saw, I saw the... <gasps> oh, look! Oh, my God. Oh, my God. It's a Lenti. Oh, my God. I freaking love that <gasps> okay i am not a lenti fan at all but that is absolutely incredible yes oh my god that is like taking the theme to the next level <gasps> it's so cool that they change from one to the other oh my god that might be my favorite lenti thing that i've ever owned i love that i could literally watch that forever <gasps> yes Oh my god okay so that's really great let me just take that out all right i saw this now yeah i got the sexy version i wanted the other one which i guess i kind of have here but i want joel with the glasses on he doesn't have glass oh wait oh wait the pop is half so the pop is half sexy half not right no it's just these two huh could you not be bothered to take your picture? Why could you not have your glasses on, Jong-ho? I want you with glasses. Okay, so, yeah. I'm a little bit annoyed that I didn't get the version that I wanted. I really wanted the other one. And I think everybody wanted that version, so I doubt anybody will be willing to trade with me. That's really annoying. But anyway, let's take a look at the um, what's the cards that we have here. These are cute though. I mean, Songwaz is, oh my god, Songwaz is absolutely stunning. What are you trying to do to me, Songhua? Wow, okay. And I did say that I like this version a lot more than I thought I was going to. Yuno's looks really good too. And Jongwa look, does look great, but I just wanted the glasses Jongwa. Somebody, please give me glasses Jongwa. Please, Tebal. I'll trade you another member. I'll give you Hongju. And there you go. You can have Hongju for glasses Jongwa, okay? So yeah, ah, I really wanted the other set, but it's okay, it's okay. I almost ordered two Seasons Greetings so that I could guarantee that I would get both sets, but I thought that was a bit excessive. Um, and I guess, I guess I can just buy Jaws. I want to see what the other ones look like though, because these ones look cute with the, with the, the gem, so. Okay, so we have one more thing to look at, which is the postcard. Now, there seems to be a lot of postcards in here. So I'm thinking slash hoping <clears throat> that we're going to get one postcard from each theme. So let's go ahead and take a look. So I was wrong. We got one individual and we got one unit. I'm so confused in my brain right now because I really thought that I preferred this way more. But why am I disappointed that there wasn't a postcard of the other version? I'm disappointed. 
So maybe I do like this version more than I thought. Maybe I am happy about getting these photo cards. Maybe it's a sign. Who knows? The world works in mysterious ways, guys. But yeah, okay. These are very cute as well. I really, I just realized he's on the phone. <laughs> I do love, you know, like this. You know, it's really giving, but you know, it's giving me like college student. He's not really giving me painter. And then you're so cute. I just think this is funny as well. Like, could you put more effort into taking that picture, Wuyong? <laughs> Your job as a photographer and you're just like, Bleh, like, <laughs> and then, oh my God, Angel, look, look at him. This is why I need that photo card. I need it. Oh, and glasses is my favorite thing in the world. Oh, I love it. Okay. And then, yeah. Oh, they're so cute. So yeah. Wow. I like it. I like it. Thumbs up. So let's do a recap. Okay, party people, here is the final lowdown on this season greetings. I liked it a lot. Very, very nice. I feel like they very successfully had a theme and made it work. Just like the 17 one, I really liked the theme of the 17 one this time. Um, <clears throat> this had a really clear story and they did both sides of it really well. I really liked the um kind of civilians thing and them kind of poking fun at each other a little and like suspecting each other and that kind of thing i'm sure the dvd is going to be really good to watch as well i might actually watch this one <laughs> um, because to be honest i don't tend to watch those uh things normally but yeah this one has me intrigued so i want to see i want to see it would be cool if they played mafia um and did some kind of like twist on it with like a thief or something um, and then for them to go from the civilian to the actual, like, thief is a really cool thing. Um, yeah. And like I said, I really thought I was going to like one version more than the others. With the last year's theme, I definitely like the cuter version more than the prom king version, for sure. But they, these two, I like both of them. It's actually kind of interesting that they, they have a similar type of thing to Seventeen. In that one of them is like a more wholesome and the other one is more like sexy and dark and dangerous so that's kind of interesting that they both went for that and i liked both of them but <clears throat> i think that this is genuinely one of the coolest things i've ever seen like i think this is i would buy the season's greetings just for this because it's so clever and it's so good i wish 17 had done that too with theirs <laughs> that would have been perfect as well for their theme so yeah really 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 like this and my standouts in terms of uh pictures and photo cards for me were Jongho obviously Songha just for the visuals Songha was giving me lots of visuals today and Mingi, Mingi really uh, came out and surprised me today. I really enjoyed his content. Good job, Mingi. Um, and also Jongo forever, my number one true love, especially with the glasses. So there we go. That was my kind of abridged ver uh, unboxing of the season's greetings. I know it was late and I'm sure that everyone's already watched the season's greetings unboxing by now, but if you did take the time to watch this, thank you so much. Um, and if you enjoyed it, you can give it a like. If you really enjoyed it and you haven't already, you can subscribe to my channel. I'm going to be posting no more Sins Grease, I don't think. I was going to buy the Stray Kids one, but I feel like the time has passed. So, yeah, I don't think I'm going to have any more Sins Greetings to unbox. But I am going to be posting a lot of vlogs. I'm going to be posting my 17 Bangkok vlog, obviously. I also have a bunch of other things that I'm really behind on. So <laughs> expect some kind of random vlogs popping, popping up every so often in the next few weeks. Um, but yeah, anyway, I appreciate you guys. And if I don't post another video uh, where I'm talking in the before the new year, happy new year, everyone. I hope you have a great time and I hope that 2024 is either just as good as this year or even better than this year or really 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 good if this year wasn't that great for you um yeah i'll see you i'll see you in the new year bye bye